so um, Rocket League has been picked up by NBC, and they're going to be airing a two-on-two tournament with a $100,000 prize pool, airing it on NBC Sports. So as I've been championing with all these Dota haters out there that this is going to end up making it, this is what's going to mainstream it. It's going to be shown on sports channels. This is its first foray into it, and I think it's only going to grow from this. Right. I mean, it's a big. It's definitely a big deal, but it, it's more of a big deal for esports than it is necessarily the biggest news for Rocket League, because you have two. You have two sides of the coin there. You have like the mainstream potential of it, of esports in general, mm-hmm. which is the NBC transition because it's so easy to pick up and put on the TV. It doesn't have people dying. It doesn't have people. You know, it's not really overly complicated. You don't have to like know how to play the game to understand the game. So it's mm-hmm. really easy for someone like NBC for something like NBC to pick it up and put it on their uh, on their thing. Uh, the biggest news that I saw that came out recently is the world champions got picked up uh, by Envious, and that's a big deal for Rocket League as an esport. To get the that kind that, of sponsor in there, right? Because if any of you are not following uh, esports very closely, there's you know there's small organizations that that uh, have teams and they have little teams. But then there's also massive organizations that have multiple teams for different games and they make, you know, these people make money, like re- like actual money. It's their job, right? Envious is one of those big, you know, those really massive organizations. So to have these two things happen simultaneously is insane for Rocket League because you have... Them transitioning into the, I guess, public market. I guess is that would that be something that you? So, yes. it's them transitioning into the public market, and then at the same time, it instantly got uh, validation as an esport. You already had Flipside Tactics, which was very validated, and a few other ones. But mm-hmm. Envious is huge. What are your guys' thoughts on that? I think the more big names that get in, the better. But I hate to say it like this: I want to see non esports sponsors start sponsoring. I don't want these guys who are used to churning over contracts left and right and poaching people. I want to see Dallas Mavericks head coach or owner, uh, Mark Cuban. I want to see him get in on it. I want to see him buy a team, sponsor a team. Mm -hmm. I want to see some of these big, really big sports guys who run it like an actual athletic organization get into the mix. I think we'll know that Rocket League has made it as a... uh as a legitimized, understood, like, real-life sport. Um, when during the Rocket League tournament, we have, you know, erection pills commercials during, <laughs> well, the, during the tournament. I don't know if you saw, right. Tom, there was brisk commercials. I mean, they're starting to get legit. Everyone yeah, knows. They're getting everyone yeah, but, knows I mean, commercials now, though. They, they really need to right. target the, the sports demographic, which is just, you know, full of Viagra and mutual <laughs> fund commercials. You know, buy this car. Get this mutual fund. Make your dick hard. Rock and <laughs> no, you forgot one. There's only really two big demographics you have to hit. Drink beer and get this pill to make your dick hard. That's all you need. That's your sports demographic right there. Maybe steaks. <laughs> steaks. <laughs> steaks. Steaks, beer, and sex. And you got your sports hey, demographics. Hey, I mean, at one point, me, me, Adam, and RS, we're sponsored by an organization, and we did get a pretty serious discount on some beef jerky. So, yeah. <laughs> I think like it was... 5% off. Oh, yeah. Oh, Jesus. Oh, you know, yeah. Like, yeah. That the much? Best, the best thing about that is that you could actually go on their site and pick up a free code for 20% off. <laughs> <laughs> oh, my God. 